Hey guys, welcome back to Uncharted The Lost Legacy. This is part three now. Feels like it's going by fast, even though there's probably oh, a lot more parts to come. I expect at least 20. At least. Maybe less. Anyway, uh, so in the last video, uh, what were we doing? Oh yeah, we, we, we were shooting some guys, and um, I realized how bad it is to not have aim assist on. Uh, but you know, at the same time, I'm not, I'm not going to be that guy, okay? I'm not going to be that guy who uses aim assist. I mean, I am that guy, but only whenever I'm, you know, playing it off camera. Right now, I'm going to suffer as much as possible. So anyway, let's get into this. Uh, let's look at the map. Okay, so we've already been to the uh, tower there. And I... Th okay, these are like all the same. Oh, no, they're not. Uh, so one has a trident, one has a bow, and the other one has an axe whatever that means and there's a mysterious spot to the northeast which I will be definitely checking out hopefully we can do this all in this video um, I think we're gonna go let's go southeast first to the trident which is gonna be back here never understood the appeal of people like Asav easy he finds men who are weak and offers them power gives them purpose purpose sounds more like bullshit to me How do you way? get tangled up with the Saab anyway? Purpose? I'd rather not go into it. He certainly seems to have a thing for you. Don't remind me. Proved useful at the time, but... Yeah. Uh, do tell. Rather not. Maybe over drinks? Not enough alcohol in the world. Oh, mud, my favorite. Oh, you got this. This is off- this is off-road. Am I going the right way? Looks like I am. I think I'm almost there. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, I got this. Right. You're the military expert. What's Asav's strategy here? He spread out his men, hoping to stop us in our treks. Not what I would do. So what would you do if you were Asav? Besides lose the beard? Hang back? Let you do the heavy lifting, then swoop in and grab up the task once you've done all the hard work. Devious. Practical. Mitigates a lot of risks. Lucky you're on my team. Yeah, you are. I'm a little surprised the sword's not doing the same thing. Maybe his expert knows more than we think. Right. All the more reason to wrap this up quickly, then. Oh, not that way. It's somewhere around here. It's a way to get up here, I'm sure. Let's go the right way. I think it's right here. Hmm, I just went around in a circle. Maybe it's up here? If I have to cut anything for ease, that way you guys don't have to watch me going around in circles. I will do that. So you see any there. weird cuts? One That's of the like, oh. trucks. Looks clear out here. Okay. Sure. Interesting circular motive. Like the disc. We're definitely in the right place. We would be so knocked down in this water. But we're tough. Alright, here we are. Check it out. It's Ganesh's trident. Matches the symbol in the tower. Ganesh. Remover of obstacles. Hmm, okay. Oh, uh, well, we're gonna be fighting a lot of obstacles, I'm sure. Right into the tall grass. Not yet. Let's keep this going as long as we can. Copy that. Shotgun, shotgun. Yeah, we're gonna have to try and keep this quiet. Let's mark some guys. One, two, probably a guy up there. While aiming, press X to swap shoulders. Gotcha. Nice. I like that. Alright. I remember doing that in Uncharted 4. We probably did. I'm just a maniac that doesn't know. Uh, Nadine, maybe get on this side. Yeah, that, that's probably the best. I don't think they see her anyway, but... Uh, get in the tall grass. I'd like to take the guy out from the top. Try to do this as stealthily as possible, and not alert everyone. Wouldn't want to do that. Unless that guy on the left or the right turns around. There we go. 
shouldn't be any more people. Hopefully it's just three, but yeah, no, that goes. All right, I'm waiting here for a second. Yeah, I'm glad I did. I don't need. To, I don't want to throw him off the ledge. Now's the time. There we go. Just the neck and move on. Uh, where'd that other guy go? Oh, he's over here. Might be able to drop him. Whoa! What the? What's Shh. that? It's nothing. Relax, man. Chill out. Where'd the other guy go? I don't know where the other guy. Oh, there he is, right there. I'm gonna ledge drop this guy. No, 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 no. Unless I can jump. All right, there we go. That works. A shotgun that might come in handy, especially with my shooting. Uh, wrong wall. That's right. Oh, uh, you know, it's gonna be about the sound of your head cracking. Come on. Could roll out and grab him. Hold on, hold. Now. There we go. A little jumping. Oh, I was going to say, I hope he doesn't drown, but then again, I did just snap his neck, so, yeah, he's good to go. Okay, uh, let me just check around, make sure there's no artifacts. Oh, what's, oh, uh, uh, hello. Oh, the Mettler, M30. I'll take it. What else we got here? Uh, pistol that I, uh, oh, silenced. Yeah, I'll take it. For now, we'll keep the rifle, though. Looks like the temple's right over here. Or, oh, hello, there's a guy up there. Any other guys? There's another one right over there, too. Sometimes I might initiate combat, but oh, there's another guy right there. They're all over the place. Okay, let's get out of the way. Goodness, there's another guy right there. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Let's take it. Shoot! Okay, well, at least I know where a bunch of them are now. Can I mark him from over there? Uh-oh. What did you find? I think we are good here. No, that guy was there. Take care of him now. Okay. A little risky, a little risky, but we got it. See that go around here? Oh god. What about this dog? Nah, 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 nah. Watch yourself. Hey, you better watch Spread yourself. Out. I got you. Oh crap, he was shotting him. Alright, into the combat. Getting off this ledge. Who's that? Is that Nadine? I can cover you. Whoop, 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 whoop. Hey, close quarter. No, I told my ass there. All right, all right. She's still taking him on. Oh, she's got him. Okay. Okay. Oh, Nadine, come on. You're being. You're not being as helpful. What the hell? Okay, I gotta find this guy's over here. Behind the wall. Then we got a guy over right here. Okay, so I'm having a little trouble with this one. I'm gonna try and be as stealthy as possible. First time I did this didn't work out too well. I need to get this guy, throw him off the ledge. Yeah, shut up, get down, get off my tower. Oh, an automatic, yeah, that's all I need. The guy over there. And there. And everywhere. We'll just fall down. I don't want to... I want to alert... Well, oh, crap. Damn! Well, you are, uh... No! Come on. Come on. Pop your head out. My goodness! Nadine! Get out of the way! Now I got guys behind me. 
Real nice. Break his face. There we go. I forgot I had a suppressor, too. There we go. Alright, I'll take this guy with a laser out. There we go. I'm gonna show you... Oh, look my cover a little better here. What the hell? You jackass! Thank you! Alright, calm down. Let me just heal up a little bit here first. Okay, uh, this guy jumped down the ledge. Hey, hey, get off the wall. He's going up. I'm gonna follow you. Whoa! I throw a grenade. I miss. I wouldn't be very good in uh, multiplayer, that's for sure. What? Oh my god, this guy is so lucky. Not that time. There we go. I don't know why I keep jumping. I think that's a lot of them. Yeah, right? that's probably all of them. Fun. Apart from working for a reckless treasure hunter. Okay, where to next? Good question. Let's explore. Take the grenade. Do you suppose this place was not taking hard that. to say. A fortress? Not the right layout for a temple. <laughs> okay, so I was doing a little exploring, and uh, you can see the ma the main temple door is uh, right over there. And uh, I came over here uh, up this little ledge, and then I went this way and found a little What's clue, this? I guess. I don't know. I've seen a few of them around. Not really sure. Um, it looks like some kind of knob or something. Some kind of like I don't know. Maybe we both have to turn it. Maybe she stays there and turns it. And I, I don't know. I don't know. I didn't open the door yet, so uh, I'm not really sure what that is. Maybe it'll make sense in a second here. Let's see what's behind this. If we can even open it. Hmm. Okay, that's not it. No, this. What's the trick here? What? Look like a button. Yeah, I just wanted you to have a go at something. Yeah, you know, you know. Of course, of course. So, what exactly did that do? It sounded like something was rumbling back here. Maybe it opened a door or something like that. Or what's this? Here goes nothing. That's a good sound. One of the spokes on the wheel just turned around. Okay, okay, so we push those in and they lock, uh, it looks like the pins move down. So there's five of them, we just push that one. Okay, so we'll go back to that one area that I was at, when I was showing you guys. And, uh, that's what that is. Basically a key, I guess. And how about you? That's two. Maybe there's some more. Might be one up here. Let's check up here. There's one right there. Okay. I, I got here's it, Nadine. I, I, I got it. Don't worry. Three down. Three down, two to go. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Wild <laughs> guess and say one's in here. How much you want to bet that I am wrong? Probably all on top of the buildings. And I don't know how far they go. Let's keep going up, I guess. No, no. Up. Up we go. They're probably all high up anyway. Well, not up here. Oh, well, okay. I'm right here. Only one left. One left, it's gonna be the hardest one to find. Nadine, watch out, get out of my way. Move! Get, get, go on. Hmm. Uh. Well, let's see, maybe check this one over here. No, I definitely can't reach that. Wow. There's some broken ankles. What do we got? What do we got? I've actually been up here before. Uh, let's see. Maybe some back. Let go of the ledge. Mm. 
I don't know if it'd be this far back. Probably not, but I'll still go up here and check it out. I don't see one up here either. There it is. Okay, so I found the last one, right here. Uh, it's in the very back. You see these uh, two buildings like this, where they have a lot of pillars connecting them. The main door is over there, hey, straight ahead. I'll get it. Whoa! Hey! Well, she's got it. Anyway, that's the one. You know, you could have done that before. Whatever. Alright, so that should unlock everything, and we should... I don't know why I'm trying to sprint. I, I played Hellblade. My last series was Hellblade, and you sprint with L1, and so I keep pressing L1. So if you see me, like, grab my rope for a second, it's me basically trying to sprint, because I think that's just how you do it. Um... So, but anyway, now, now that all the, uh... All the keys, all the pins on the door are pushed now, so we can actually get through, and probably, hopefully, well, there's nobody, there shouldn't be anyone in here. Okay. Did it. But I'm right, I did. Oh, come on. Looks like we're going under. Radio. Yeah, we can fit. Well, that's comforting. Now we're locked. Oh, we're out. Wait, wait a minute. This strange feeling that we could have just walked around. Here we go. Yes. Some kind of. Well, looky here. Torch. What are you willing to bet? Told you it's some kind of key. Gold star for you. Now let's see what it does. What is it? Ancient Hoysalar jigsaw puzzle. Okay. Turn the dial. X to change active dial. Okay, so right now we're turning the uh, whole thing. Of course. I'm making a trident. So if we press X, I can turn just uh, this one. And I don't think it matters which way I turn. Uh, that one's okay, I guess. Now this one, we can turn this way. And then this one. Oh, this whole thing turns. Okay, so get that one where it needs to be. Whoops. And then turn this one. Oh, okay, I see. We have to actually, I have to really line this up. I feel like it would line up there. Oh, not quite. Interesting. Uh, oh, wait. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I thought the try. I thought it was a completely different way. That's a lot easier. Hello, sir. Now what? Now, I guess we turn this crank. And see what happens next. You think it's safe? You know that treasure hunting is not a good gig for the risk of us, right? Now there's being a mercenary. Difference is when I pull the pin on a grenade, I know it's going to happen next. My way's much more fun. <laughs> what a gamble. <laughs> yeah, so basically that puzzle was a lot easier. This the trident was upside down, so make sure you flip it the right way. Look at that. Holy hell. There's a massive relief carved into the side of that mountain. And you were worried we were going to turn that crank and die. Guess it's good I've got an archaeologist's daughter with me. It must have been fun growing up, eh? It had its moments. I learned a lot. Hoysala Empire was kind of his thing. Took up a lot of his time, though. Me, if I go digging for treasure, I better make a buck or two. Well, sure. I don't take big risks without a good payday. I imagine so. Like running an army, huh? That's a big responsibility. Second nature. It's my father's company. He retired, I took over. Family business. Mm. <laughs> Made a real mess of it. Well, you should know. Heard you and those Drake brothers are close. Yeah, well. 
session for another time. So, where to next? There's the fort marked with an axe on the mountain there. And that fort marked with a bow in the lake bed. Hmm. Suppose I should have asked about the Drakes before I took the job. Not much to tell. I know Nate pretty well. Sam less so. He seemed to just appear out of thin air. Okay, so we got a little backstory there on uh, Chloe. I didn't, I didn't realize that she was a, I guess, an archaeologist's daughter. Um, maybe they explained that in Uncharted Three or Uncharted Two and Three. I don't, I don't know. I, I never heard of that. So maybe that's a little backstory, a little, little more you get to know about Chloe. And of course, Nadine. You know, we kind of know a little bit about her. You know, she obviously was in charge of Shoreline, the, um, uh, I guess, it was a private military. Uh, force that she controlled in Uncharted 4 it was her father's, but then she inherited it and kind of made a mess out of it. If you've played Uncharted 4, you know that uh, she eventually kind of succumbed to it. Uh, but still, uh, even if you haven't played Uncharted 4, most of it still makes sense. Uh, they were talking about the Drake brothers, so there's a little bit of information there for you. Um, you know, kind of understanding the characters, it might help, if, like I said, if you did play the other games, but not necessarily. This is still a standalone game, so it's not too confusing. But anyway, so far, it's been they've been doing a good job. I, I like it, and I'm enjoying it. Uh, so anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you so much. Um, and let me know what you think. It helps out a lot. I'd love to hear from you. Uh, let me know in the comment section uh, if you guys are planning on getting this game. And uh, out of all the characters, which one is your favorite? You know, even though you can't play some of the characters, uh, you really only were able to play Nathan. Um, and, and that was pretty much it. But uh, I'd have to say my top, my top two favorite characters would definitely be uh, Victor, Sullivan, and Chloe. They were always just, you know, especially Victor. I mean, you, you can't have an Uncharted game without him. So let me know down in the comment section. I'd love to hear from you. Uh, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Y'all take care.